another My View TV exclusive. Please remember to hit the notification bell, like, share, and subscribe. I don't bring nobody forward in your future for me. Everything where you see up my natural talent. Let me tell you something. You see, when you know what to please the audience with, it's simple, me. Wagwan well, people, open body no okay, open body no right. Some people dream of success, while other people get up every morning and make it happen. What are you going to do? You are going to sit down and dream every day, or you are going to get up and go out and make success happen. Every day above ground, it's a blessing, it's an awesome day to be alive. Happy Tuesday, each and every one of you. Yeah, man. Big up on yourself, everybody who over here. But hold on there a minute, people, before me read the news. Me need to do a little house cleaning. Yes. Make I tell you something. Yeah, one people may I talk to. Remember what I say? Tell a friend, tell a friend, tell another friend. So when the friend come over here, yeah, friend, who may I talk to now? Nobody feel like you can come, come tell me, change how we deliver our program. No, 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 no. It not going to work. Not one day, Mr. No, 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 go up on the TV station and say, yo, tell them when the Prime Minister talk, don't play cash pot. That's still a go play. If Prime Minister talk on a cash pot time, you best believe it. Prime Minister go in a corner, in a little side, and everybody go and see them cash pot card. That is more important. So when me tell you, say them hide the news in the sports section, and me go around there and find it for no. Nobody else start with it, you know. But guess what them start do now? Them start put the front of the paper. And another little thing, the people them who don't understand them, me say, angle them, bangle themselves. Let me explain it to you. Know. Don't feel like you can come, come send me no bag of picture and say, yo, my view, see you keep push the Tom Jane. You see the two of them, them have a bag of gun, and of them kill off all of the people, them run a thing back too. I can tell you something. Me and I set up nobody life, you know. That is not my job. I'm going to bang on yourself. Since you know them have gun, and fool look at people, them have gun, you know, go and go squash it out, them, man. You understand Mexican style when you go and go war. I said what I said and I mean what I said. I mean, I take it back. I mean, was somebody in the comment section I said, my view. But on the use, I was supposed to kill the farmer for dead culture. I was supposed to talk. Yes, I said that. But let me tell you something. But I feel like you can't come use stone calf by me. Yes. Who no bad people may talk to you? Know, I said in picture for come and put a picture about yo. This is man bad and that them and the bad. Because you want police to slap them. No, 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 no. Angle the angle yourself. Anyway, people. Let me jump in on the news now. Because I know it to now wait for. Two men who were killing I like you in Papin St. Andrew on Saturday has been identified as Dale Tate and O'Keel Darling. Yes, people. Remember me telling about them already? Right up and modeling the people them call up the name and the people them from up on the side they say I saw the name. Resident report heard gunfire at about 6 p.m. and called the police. Both men later found at their home suffering a bullet wound. Dead, dead, dead man, them can't go hospital people. For who don't know who I know, a pops and him friend me attack when get slapped with. You understand on the house, but don't have somebody else injured and like the same incident. Ne? Me just want to make sure they get the bird surf to kick name now. We still don't get the other picture of the other one yet. A couple of the people them never take no picture of me and I'm going to know close. But as soon as we get it, we are making people them have it. Ten persons were arrested and charged in St. Elizabeth on Monday for breaching the Disaster Risk Management Act. This is all them care about. This is all them care about. They don't care about the high level of crime and violence. People, you know, say them don't like me because me only talk it out. But guess who don't care? Me. They were seen on the road despite Monday being declared a no movement day. Our news team was informed that the group who operated a store in Junction were detained on Front Hill Main Road. I slap them, I should have slapped them with. Them now have no need for them on the road. People just don't like here. Me and behind the shadow. They reportedly told the police they were on their way to Savla Mar to conduct business. Ruan Ellington, yes, people. Ruan Ellington don't know him. I'm at the superintendent on the other side of the deputy soup. The operational officer in charge for the Saint Elizabeth Police Division said the group was escorted to the Black River Police Station and wrong place when I escort them. You know it's part when I escort them go. Right down at the mag. Slap on the slap them with. Where them are do par road. Since you know what area will feel, you know. Speaking of that now, let me talk about some next people with the on the road who not here. One bunch of careless people come out and enough of them are tell lie about them. Essential work and lie them are tell. Two persons have been rushed to the Spanish Town Hospital after sustaining injury in a collision between a Voxy minivan and a 10 wheeler truck along the Mandela Highway in St. Catherine. So, pay for me to have a stop right there and take a look at notes before I go around a flat bridge and I'm going to know what I'm around there. So, you understand, around there is an exit of carelessness. You see the people that are injured? They're in a critical condition. Yes, people, but guess who escaped? The driver of both motor vehicles reportedly escaped harm. Always the case. 
All the rest the case, them a speed and then them sister them a get themselves in a danger and them know how to jump out left or no. Police personnel from the nearby ferry police station declined to speak to our media. Yes, them never want to give the information. And for the look on the screen now, papers, so eyewitness report that the brother you were sitting in the ditch, fame fault. Him cast everything for happen. Them say overtake him a try, overtake it up and reach right there. So you understand? Take on the time on the road when that speed go. A matter of fact, some man not even step on the road. How so much on the road and the numbers are going to give you in the life? According to data issued by the Road Safety Unit on Monday, September 6th, there have been 320 crash fatalities this year. That is 6% or 18 more than for the corresponding period in 2020. And like how we depp on crash, and we tell you say we are going to flat bridge, look what I'm around there now, people. People don't need to worry yourself, you understand? We have the rest of the video can show you. Big up the video personnel, you catch every single thing. But I can ask you one question. What so much people are up on the road in a no movement there? Police them not doing no work, man. The police them not doing no work. So you see the accident here? Five persons injured in the crash. I see that big careless trailer driver there. He needs to stay far away from us steering. Them no need to put him back round, no steering for drive, nothing. Take where I'm licensed. Take where I'm licensed. I guarantee you, no people, any how this take amateur video never come out, everybody would have blamed the carman and say, yo, a taxi him a run, and he might do this, and he might do that, and I. he must be now overtake. See, then now, this careless truck man cast all the way up. Right now, could I read the news differently, you know? I say everybody in the car drop out, you know, because of the truck man, you know, people. Me be honest, you don't know, people watching the cell phone and up on the road. Because many of these drivers are not drivers. They are only steerers. They only can hold the steering wheel and press gas. They don't know to do nothing more. Right now, me going to have a client and because I see the police, them. Anytime you see them make one step forward, them take a million step backwards. I can't understand them, them just big and full full. And then when them done, them keep press conference and chat a handbag of foolishness. Detective assigned to the area three major investigation division has made a major breakthrough. Yes, people, listen to this. A major breakthrough in their homicide probe in Clarendon with the arrest of three major players fingered in 10 murders in the parish. The combined efforts of detective assigned to MID and the Clarendon Criminal Investigation Branch them go road go waste time, me I tell you who them be have resulted in the clearing up of murder on Friday, September 3rd the murder go as far back as 2017 and include three double murder, hold on a minute so police, Fitz Bailey and friends, you come here who don't really I tell me say from 2017, now look for them my boy, I know it's 2021 and I pick them up for them on vacation tell me how that makes sense tell me how that makes sense a one bedroom apartment would have been better, you know. Yes, one bedroom apartment down under the ground, cool, you know. AC down there, them can't live down there all the days of them life. You understand? For the road, they eat them. But when you carry them around, they have a waste tax tax money. It makes no sense. People, me know they're not going to believe me. But I'm going to let the big E that fits me, you know. As the JCF continues to focus on our murder reduction strategy, the Era 3 Major Investigation Division and the Clarendon Criminal Investigation Branch have made a major breakthrough in solving 10 murder cases which commenced from as far back as 2017. In the matter at hand, one individual, George Robinson, O.C. Killer Boot, was charged for multiple murders and among the other person charged was a 17-year-old boy. This I believe demonstrate or resolve to say that if you commit a crime you will be brought to justice the fact is that no matter how long it takes we are going to continue to focus our investigation and it reinforced the improvement of our investigative skills in terms of exploiting technology exploiting other resources that are available ex exploiting the sciences as well and the old time detective work that was demonstrated in resolving these matters and i want to commend the men and women of clarendon and the men and women of the major investigation division era three for sticking to the job and i want to again reassure the public 
that no matter how long it takes, no matter how hard it seems, we are going to continue to focus. And as long as we continue to focus and develop our skill, we will get to the bottom of some of these major crimes that have been committed. Commendation again to the men and women and the JCF will continue in our resolve to investigate and put before the court those who continue to perpetrate crime. Really, we the city of Jamaica beg you one favor. And in a resignation, yeah man, and in a resignation, what kind of care before court you are talking about? A six man fear if them a carry them before the pastor for the pastor dash them down in our wall. Why you are talking about carry them behind bars no matter how long it take? No, no, no. I slap the people them want to know, slap them with. I some dangerous suit them with, I some old land pan, you know. For the people them want to know, I can tell you about them. 22 year old George Robinson, otherwise called Killer Boot of Racetrack District Clarendon, who has been charged for allegedly involving in all 10 murder. Yes, people. And 26 year old Chavis. Hardy of New Village St. Catherine who has been charged for his alleged involvement in four of the murder. I said the little 17 year old boy, yes him now, him involving a two of the murder them. And really I tell me say, Fitzbilly and friends just went and picked them up and carried them behind bars. No, 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 no. I slap my business the people them are dealing with Fitzbilly. Me I tell you the truth.